Hi everyone and welcome back to another video and another flip of my Giglio Medium Campania and this is the yellow here and she is pretty chunky. I don't think I can, no, I can't close her. I have 25mm rings and, but it doesn't bother me that. I very rarely close my planners anyway. So let's dive in. I did want to update her a little bit for autumn, um, now that we are in September, but my printer is not working, so I'm going to have to wait or look through my stash and see if I can find anything from last year. So it is pretty much the same, um, but I still thought I would do a little flip for you. These pockets are still the same Pokemon cards. I have these little appointment sheets and then some flags. I have some stickers behind here and then two bank cards that I'm just keeping a hold of and then a picture of my babies there as well. I have more stickers in here and a receipt and then a little drawing from my kiddo. I did switch out my Ollie clip to be more autumn like uh, so I've just got this leopard print one. I did have the pink one on before. And then under here I have this September plan with B freebie and then some of those appointment um, little pages there just with future appointments on. I also added this little um, this little card here from journaling home and then I have my home card at the back. And this, this deco it just makes me happy. It makes me want to come and look in my planner so that's why I add bits here and there. This first section is my lists so I still have all my lists. I have recipes, notes, school stuff and then a couple of extra sheets here. I do have more school information there and then just some Stalogy paper at the back. Again if I need to scribble anything down I do it there drawings from my kiddos and then pictures and you get into my calendar section so I have little tabs here for the end of the year this is just an overview and this monthly is from SM plans so I do have the whole year in and I haven't yet moved 2024 in here I'm not sure what I want to use for that yet so I have just been writing notes down here um, on the back of this sheet for yeah dates for next year really. I have this little 2024 year at a glance which again is plan with B and then on the back of that I just have some acetate and a little picture. I made this dashboard here uh, and it's just quotes from the fourth wing. Sticky notes. I also made this little daily reminder sheet so it's just got 50 daily reminders and I enjoy that being there. My little colour coding key and then we have my weeklies. So these are from Peanuts Planico here and this tracker is also from Peanuts Planico as well. So I've just paired them together and it's working really, really, really well. I'm enjoying it a lot. I have a little extra sticky note here for homework for my eldest who's just moved up to high school. So there's a lot for her to keep track of. So I'm helping her out a little bit. I need to print some more. I think I have next week's and then I need more. So we're going to do that hopefully when my printer starts working. More sticky notes. And then this is my little brain dump section. I did move this, the Plan With B inbox. I just wasn't feeling it and I've gone back to the... Filofax one, so I just have an extra sheet in there. I've just been highlighting stuff if it's important or I need to get it done soon. To buy a list, more notes and stuff. Um, this is my little inbox sheet with to dos and notes and reminders, that kind of thing on. This is my minimal planner and it's just laminated. I've had this for quite a while now. And you get into my dailies. I did think about switching to day on two page, but I do think I'm just going to leave it. It was after this day that I was wondering if I needed to switch. No, it wasn't. Which day was it? Um, it was, I think it might have been this day. Oh, this day. 
it was this day when I was wondering if I might need to switch just because of how full it is but I think I might be okay I've managed since then um, and I can always use a sticky note if I have extra things to write down but as you can see like yesterday was pretty um, full this is today here and then I have enough for the rest of September in there a couple of notes pages here and then more cuteness And then you get into my health and wellness section. So I've got um, some self-care ideas, self-care routine, bucket list. This is a memory sheet. And then I have my reading log for the year here. And then you get into my habit trackers. I do have most of these inserts, some of these inserts listed in the description as I can't remember off the top of my head where they are from. My gratitude sheets and then ideas for a bad day. And then my little fitness section, so I'm just tracking my workouts here. Behind here I have uh, progress pictures, weight log, measurement log, that kind of thing and then it goes into my a little printout of my workout that I'm doing. I'm halfway through week six now, which is really nice. My workout overviews, and then a little workout tracker here. Then a mood tracker. Behind that, I have my cycle tracker and my health logs. So I'm just gonna skip past those. More pictures. Again, this is something that I just made myself. And then you get into my little home section, which is just meals. Um, so I have this meal planner from Crossbow Printables. This little tracker, which I stopped using uh, a week before the end of August. And I haven't done one for September. And then you get into my kids stuff. Then you get into my kids section. So I've got... Um, school calendars here and then they've each got a tab and inside they've got a health logs, any notes um, that I might need, you know, for school or different things, clubs, that sort of thing. And then I have the pets information at the back as well. This little drawing and then my little pocket here. Here I just have some papers and things that I need to sort out. Pockets are basically still the same, and the back pocket is two. I hope you've enjoyed this flip, and if you have any questions, let me know, and I will try to get back to you as soon as I can. Thanks for watching. Bye.